Yo, 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 yo. What is going on, guys? Shilly Philly here, and today we're going to be playing some Pekka Ram Rider. But if you do enjoy this video, guys, please leave a like and subscribe. We just hit 700 subscribers, guys. Thank you so much for all the love and support. I can't believe this happened. But yeah, I just want to say thank you so much. If you guys want to go smash that subscribe button right now, that would be awesome. But uh, yeah, let's hop into the first match here. Alrighty, guys, getting into the first match here against Julie Gamer YouTube. We'll give him the good luck. And an expo. What the heck? And I will use this. And I have the bar barrel too. Kind of an overcommit, but like. At least we will get some damage on his archers here. And a little bit on the tower, so definitely we'll take that. So if we play this right, it shouldn't be a bad matchup for us. Don't know if he's got anything too crazy. Let's see what he plays for the bandit. And he has a knight. So, ooh, I did not see that. Ram Rider does not get down in time. He's going to log here. Oh, he doesn't log. Interesting. He does have a Tesla, though. If I had a Lightning, that would be really convenient, but unfortunate. Hmm. Let's see how we can come back here. I will E-Wiz in the opposite lane. And we can go in with a P.E.K.K.A. here, be a little aggressive. And I will bandit the opposite side, he will use his archers. And we take out his Tesla here, so that's awesome, that P.E.K.K.A. gets to the tower. And it gets him two hits right now, three hits, that is awesome. And we will almost take his tower here, so definitely a great way to come back. I will baby dragon, just in case he wants to get back to his expo. And we do have lightning now. I will ram rider. And did he give up? No, he didn't give up yet. And I will have to lightning here. And we can get a P.E.K.K.A. down if he goes in with his expo. And, yep, we get our P.E.K.K.A. down. Bar barrel coming in. And I will E-Wizard here. And looking really solid. Not much this guy's able to do here. And I will Ram Rider. Get a low bandit down. Bar Barrel as well. And yeah, that's going to be a good game. So GG's. But pretty an easy win there. But, uh, yeah, guys, I will see you back in the next match. Oh, oh, what a prediction. Well played. Well played. I like that. <laughs> That's a P.E.K.K.A. in the back. Hmm. And I will E-Wizard and Snowball here. And we're just going to Bar Barrel. <laughs> and we're going to try it again. <laughs> Good game, that was funny. <laughs> but I will see you guys back in the next. Alrighty, guys, into the next next match here against Santino. Give Santino the good luck. And we can bandit at the bridge here. See what he plays. And it is a goblin gang. I will snow. Oops. So we just missed some of that. It is what it is. Ram Rider will help out a little bit. And he has the Dark Prince, so he will take the charge. And he does lose the shield on the Dark Prince, so I will definitely take that. And the Dark Prince will charge, so I will e -whiz. And Bar Barrel will clutch up. He wasted his Tornado there, so I'm going to go with a Bandit in the opposite lane. See what he's going to play here. And he plays an E- what? An Inferno Dragon. So I will snowball here. And I think I have to lightning here. That is like unfortunate, but 
he gets some damage back. I have to... Uh, do I just E-Wiz? I think we just E-Wiz, try to save our tower. But we have some split lane damage, so... Hmm... I think we baby dragon. Okay, yeah. Good thing we baby dragoned. It'll splash on both, but we're going to lose our tower here. I will bar barrel, though. And he's just going to keep spamming. That's fine. We just have to save up now for double elixir. Hopefully we can get a nice comeback in. I will snowball. Take out most of his push. And he will get a goblin swing, but that's fine. Hmm... Alright, how do we come back and win this game here? I guess we have to play it smart. And I will peck it in the back now for double elixir. And there's a dark prince. So I will e-wiz behind this and go in with a baby dragon. And that's like a strange tornado kind of. I will bar barrel kind of miss. But, hmm, I will get another E-Wizard down here for the P.E.K.K.A. And we did a ton of damage. And look at that, guys. Looks like we're coming back. I will Baby Dragon over here. And, yeah, there's no way he's going to do anything. Good game. Sorry, Santino, but looking pretty solid for us here. And, yeah, I will see you guys back in the next match. Pretty easy win against Santino. Alright guys, into this match against Mini Rick here. And yeah, pretty simple stuff. He's gonna go with the Skelly Barrel. Ram Rider, slows it down. Use our Bar Barrel, and we will get a hit from the Ram Rider. So that is awesome right there. Barbarian coming in. Bandit is literally perfect right now. I don't know because the game just started, but he is like no good... Uh, yeah, he's got no good counter in that besides the E-Wiz now. But he had to waste a lot of Elixir, so I will E-Wiz on top. I do miss some of the bats, but it is what it is. And that Skelly Barrel will get a lot of damage. But we have the lead right now, up about 300, so I can't complain. And Ram Rider coming in. He uses Tombstone and Skelly King. And it almost gets to the tower, but not quite. But yeah, we use a bandit and a snowball. He won't get any damage with the Skelly King ability. And now our baby dragon has to be addressed. So he goes in with a barrel, leaves the baby dragon. And yeah, looking pretty good for us. And he is a Skelly Barrel coming down. He will keep getting damage with the Skelly Barrel. We don't have a building in this deck, unfortunately, but... I do kind of enjoy playing with the Ram Rider. It is kind of fun. And e -Wiz gets another shot off. So that is lovely. And, yeah. He starts to go in here. We get a P.E.K.K.A. down. Wasted Skelly King and Bats. So look at this push we have coming in. He doesn't have anything. He has a tombstone now. And the fact that he used it, we can go with our Ram Rider soon. But we will band it because he's got no counter for anything here. And yeah, you guys get taken out by the P.E.K.K.A. The P.E.K.K.A.'s last act. <laughs> and yeah, that was an easy good game there. But uh, yeah guys, GG to this guy. And yeah, I'll see you back in the next match match here up against splash and we're just going to use a baby dragon here in the back for his skelly drags pretty good stuff and yeah he goes in with a golem in the back so you know what that means guys we have to defend with our pekka and he's probably so mad at this point but his deck is actually pretty good because we don't have the greatest counters for the night witch and the baby dragon we can lightning it but when you get a P.E.K.K.A. down to defend it, it's kind of hard to hit a Lightning in single. 
So I decided to go with a Ram Rider here, I believe, in the back. We'll slow everything down. And Baby Dragon now will be slowed down. It's getting targeted by the e -Wiz. And he gets some damage, but I get some damage as well. We get some more. And yeah, look at this elixir lead we have. I love to see that. And we send in a bandit here. He's got nothing besides a tornado. And I baby dragoned here at the bridge, I think, because I had so much more elixir. I had no good play there. But he uses a baby dragon of his own. And I know I can't really use my P.E.K.K.A. Because if I do, I just kind of have to defend until he plays his P.E.K.K.A. So we do e -Wiz here in the back, I believe. Kind of wait a second. But, if yeah. So, like, this is, like, the worst play you can do, guys. Don't golem in the back. Like, I can just go with the Ram Rider now. You have no... <laughs> nothing you can do about it, so... Yeah, at this point, I knew it was a good game. And I put the Pekka down right in front of this, and we saved the e -Wiz. But, yeah, that Pekka is still going to have so much health. Or not the Pekka, the Golem. But it's fine. As long as we get his counter push out of here, the Golem can, you know, do whatever. Bandit's on top of it. Shouldn't do too much damage. And we're right there in the opposite lane. Look at that. He has to either choose to try to get this tower here or defend. And he keeps choosing to try to get this tower. But you can see he's getting very desperate here. I decided to snowball as well. And he may get a hit or two, but it's not going to do too much for him at the end of the day. Because if he wants to win, we can just ram rider on the right. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, GG's to this guy. He had no chance, but... Yeah, guys, I will see you back in the next match. Alright, guys, hopping into the last match here against this person. I will throw out the good luck. And we'll start out with the bandit at the bridge here. Hmm. Fisherman coming in. And he's going to go in immediately. Kind of just have to... Bam, everything on this RG. Hopefully it only gets one hit. And it does get one hit, so that's cool. But at least we will have the P.E.K.K.A. in Cycle next time. But the E-Wiz is on tower, so I do like to see that. Getting a few chip shots. Unfortunately, he will get another Phoenix. But I guess we will have to Ram Rider. And I will Ram Rider now. And it unfortunately does get a hit on top, but... Phoenix is gone. And he does activate King Tower, so that's fine, honestly. We still get a lot of damage. I will go in with my Bandit here. And I will Baby Dragon as well. Lumberjack might just get a Rage on the tower. I don't think it'll get a hit. Oh, it does get a hit. Interesting. Fisherman does get a couple hits as well. Hmm. Kind of just have to stall here. And I guess we will E-Wizard over in this lane. And maybe we can go in with a Ram Rider here. Not too bad. And I will Snowball the Spear Goblins. And nice, we do hit the Ice Spirit as well. So that is really clutch. That Ram Rider is doing so much damage. And I will Bandit here. And I guess I would... Yeah, I'm going to go in with a Bar Barrel on the Lumberjack. Just to make sure it doesn't get any damage. But yeah, now we're up a thousand. Double elixir. Let's get it. Alrighty, he's gonna Phoenix. I guess we'll baby dragon in this lane. And Ram Rider. Unfortunately, we don't have enough for the P.E.K.K.A. yet. But I will just P.E.K.K.A. on top of this. And we do get a hit at least. Hmm... I guess I'll Bandit for the Lumberjack. And I'll go with the Bar Barrel over on this lane. We definitely need to make something happen here. 
get an E-Wizard down, and we have enough for the P.E.K.K.A., but hmm, we're going to have to get a Ram Rider down. I don't know if we'll have enough time, though. Ram Rider's coming in. And Ice Spirit doesn't come in in time. Yeah, I think we're going to get the tower here. So we will have a nice overtime match. Hmm. All right. How do we do this here? Baby Dragon coming in. Nice. He used to play the Lumberjack. E-Wizard as well. And I will have to P.E.K.K.A. here. And he fireballs. But that's a good fireball by him. But now he's going to have a tougher time trying to defend. I will Snowball here and Bandit. And Bandit does dash onto the tower, which is really awesome. Bandit's getting a ton of damage. I will have to E-Wizard here. He's going to get ready for an RG. And I'll Baby Dragon. And Ram Rider's coming in. And I will just snowball here. Bandit, bar barrel. I don't know if we're gonna have enough to stop this. Hmm, he's gonna get a lot of damage. But I will go right back in with another Ram Rider. And I will E-Wizard in the middle here. Hopefully, oh no, it doesn't get the charge. Oh no, I think we're just gonna barely lose this, guys. No, we win! Good game! Baby Dragon clutches up! Oh, man. GG's, guys, but somehow we pulled out the win there. But, yeah, if you did enjoy the video, please leave a like and subscribe, guys. But, yeah, I will see you back in the next video. Peace.